Introduction to WordPad Lofty Goal In this lesson, you will learn that a computer is a wonderful machine and it helps us in many ways like writing, notes and stories. I have become tired of writing stories on paper. Can you help me to write these on the computer? Sure, crazy. You can write on a computer using a program called the WordPad. Let's learn more about this program. WordPad WordPad is a word processor program. It helps us to create, store and print text. Starting WordPad WordPad can be started as follows. Step 1. Click on the Start button. Step 2. Click on All Programs. Step 3. Click on Accessories. Step 4. Click on WordPad. The following window opens up on the screen. It has the following parts. Quick Access Toolbar, Title Bar, WordPad Button, Tabs, Ribbon, Working Area. Quick Access Toolbar. It provides us with different options which can be clicked and accessed easily. Title Bar. It shows the program name and the file name of your document. WordPad Button. It contains buttons that you can use to print, save and open WordPad documents. Ribbon. Group of tools. Writing space. It is the place where you type. Some more. The small eye-shaped beam which blinks in the writing area is the mouse pointer. Let's see how to write in WordPad. Typing in WordPad. Type the following letters in WordPad. Mighty and computer. Hello friends, I am Mighty. We are working in WordPad. What do you want to learn? I know everything. Step 1. Start typing where the cursor is blinking. Step 2. Give space between two words using the spacebar key. Step 3. Press the Enter key when a line is complete. Step 4. Now type the next line. Your text will appear in the following manner. Hearts, which key would you like to use to go to the beginning of the new line from the end of the completed line. Let us now learn how to make this text stylish and beautiful. Formatting text. Formatting means changing the text alignment, font type, font size, font color and font style. To shift text in the center of the page. Step 1. Select the text Mighty and Computer by placing the cursor to the left of the word mighty and dragging it till the end of the word computer. The selected text gets highlighted. Step 2. Click on Home tab to use the formatting buttons. Step 3. Bring the mouse pointer on the center button in the paragraph group and click on it. The text will come in the center of the page. Some more. By default text is set in the left side of page. Change text style. Look at these three buttons in the font group. Bold. To give extra thickness to the text. Italic. Text which usually appears slanted to the right. Underline. Adds a line under the selected text. Step 1. Select the text Mighty and Computer. Step 2. Click on Home tab to use buttons in the font group. To make bold, italic or underline, use buttons. Step 3. To change font color, click the down arrow and choose a color of your choice. Here we have selected the text. The text will appear as shown below. Wow! Now it looks more attractive. Saving the document. After finishing your work, you can save your document. Step 1. Click the word button, then click save. The save as dialog box appears. Step 2. In the save as dialog box, click the location where you want to save the document. Step 3. In the file name box, type a number for your document. Step 4. 
Click the Save button. Your file gets saved at the desired location. Hots. What would happen if you click the Cancel button in the Save As dialog box? Practical. Type the cartoon movie's name in WordPad and set the text as per the given instructions. Jai Hanuman. Underline. Red color. Bal Ganesh. Italic. Green color. Chota Bheem. Bold. Blue color. Now save it on the desktop by the name Cartoon Movies. Which one is correct? 